In today's digital era, where content spreads at lightning speed, privacy can be difficult to maintain, especially for those in the public eye. Recently, a video reportedly involving social media influencer, Minahil Malik, went viral, triggering a wave of discussions, concerns, and debates across various platforms like Twitter, TikTok, and Instagram. The leaked content, though rapidly shared and reposted, has sparked heated discussions on the ethics of virality, privacy, and the exploitation of personal content in the digital age. Minahil Malik, a rising figure on platforms like TikTok and Instagram, was initially known for her lifestyle content, fashion posts, and engaging personality. Her relatable, aspirational content gained her a loyal following across different demographics. However, this incident marked a significant shift from her usual public persona, casting her into an unwanted spotlight of controversy. The leaked video, the subject of rampant speculation and countless discussions, was shared on various platforms before being flagged and taken down, though not before it spread extensively. The virality of the video wasn't purely accidental. Social media algorithms and user engagement through sharing, commenting, and reacting helped propel it to widespread attention. On platforms like Twitter, hashtags related to the video trended within hours, making it impossible for Malik or her team to control the narrative surrounding the incident. As is often the case, once such content is leaked online, it takes on a life of its own, with individuals outside of the situation dissecting, judging, and sometimes mocking the people involved. This incident shines a light on the darker side of virality. While influencers and brands often seek virality to boost their profiles, the kind of attention Malik received illustrates how damaging it can be when content involves private or intimate moments. For Minahil Malik, this invasion of privacy has brought about public scrutiny, memes, and derogatory comments from some parts of the internet, reflecting a lack of empathy in online communities. The incident has also raised questions about the role of social media platforms in managing such content. Though sites like Twitter and Instagram have guidelines against explicit or harmful material, enforcing these rules consistently remains a challenge. By the time such content is flagged and removed, it has already been downloaded, shared, and viewed by thousands if not millions of people. This reactive approach by social media platforms underscores the difficulty of controlling content in a world where information spreads almost instantly. On a legal level, sharing private non-consensual content is a violation of privacy and can fall under revenge porn laws in many jurisdictions. However, even with legal protection, the damage to an individual's reputation and mental health can be irreparable. The emotional and psychological toll of having private content exposed to the public can be devastating. Victims often experience shame, anxiety, and depression, compounded by the knowledge that the content may resurface at any time, despite efforts to contain it. As society increasingly navigates the complexities of the digital landscape, incidents like Minahil Malik's viral video serve as reminders of the need for more robust protections, both legally and socially for individuals whose privacy has been breached. The Internet's tendency to prioritize entertainment over empathy only exacerbates the harm caused by such leaks. Moving forward, fostering a culture that values personal privacy and respects the consequences of online actions is essential for preventing similar incidents. So, the case of Minahil Malik highlights the pitfalls of virality in the digital age, where the rush to share and engage often comes at the cost of human dignity and privacy. It serves as a cautionary tale for both influencers and everyday users, reminding us that what becomes viral isn't always what should. Stay subscribed for more videos.